welcome back to the channel i'm king of madden in today's video we're back playing uh star wars jedi fallen order i had an issue with my entire backlog so i had to delete it all that's why these videos are coming late then add some other stuff to deal with before i came back to recording basically but as you can see here right <clears throat> i got up to 43 percent and then i went back to edit those videos which was like i think it was like nine or six or nine videos that i had banked and then it was like uh oh what was i doing i was touching my i was messing with my settings trying to figure out how to get multi-track uh stuff from my recordings didn't work out and then i also forgot to actually like test the settings that i tried to switch to before i made six to nine videos and then lost all of those because it either had it either had game sound or it had actually no it had no game sound it just had my voice and at first i was going to try and make it work and then i realized that it was all like six to nine videos so i just cut them out but anyways here we are back where we left off i had to play back or i played back up to where we were and actually i was playing it on a harder difficulty just for a slight difference but that does slow down the game's progress a lot so i'll keep it on story mode like this mode and story mode are two totally different game modes which makes me scared to even try the higher ones personally like grandmaster you have to be exact with your timing and the enemies are doing like real damage meanwhile this one's just like yeah i mean you can have fun so i'm gonna keep having fun then and i can't hear the game personally hopefully the game sound isn't too loud or anything but i'll find that out when i'm editing so so the thing is that i didn't realize too is why it's so much faster is enemies are far less aggressive oh, another one of these wonder if they connect Oops. Well, you saw I tried to do the one where I jumped over him, but uh, that didn't really work out. Or at least I hope that you've seen that before. But I have this little dash, and if I jump doing the dash, it'll like, it'll jump over what I'm dashing at, and swing them like swing against the back of them, basically. Hey. Damn, I'm mad too, cause I think I. No, no, that was after. No, I think I did lose like what I thought was one of my smoother encounters, but also. I feel like it means way less after realizing that the aggression of the enemies goes down as well. But let's work through this. Also, I had to take a break from playing the game because I couldn't replay stuff that I had just played and not have it be, be just droning over like, oh yeah, and here's this again. Stuff like that. So I just took a little break. Okay. And there's this little flower here too. So we'll be able to grow this when we head back to the um, ship. Are pretty cute. But I don't think I've showed that yet either. I'm trying to remember too, because I know in the later videos I definitely did, but those are gone now. I think that's what's going to be the issue now instead of me just not giving the same enthusiasm as the game needs. Something too I talked about was like I've never seen a storm do that before. How Cal is supposedly like yeah, lost his incredible. connection to the force and lost a lot of his force abilities, but he's maintained this uh pretty unique one of having being able to freeze time or like freeze objects and slow them down. So I think that's still pretty interesting because especially with that storm right there, he would have had to freeze several items at once in order for it to work out. Um So it's weird that his connection to the force is damaged, but he's still able to do stuff. So well, that seems so advanced because unless he's grabbing the wind with his force, then it doesn't make sense that he's slowing everything down or he's grabbing every single item. But I, it's still either way you cut it, it's going to be advanced like force usage. Now let's see where we have to go. I'm in the tomb. Massive. And the Empire? No sign of them down here. What about Cordova? Still not sure what I'm supposed to find. He's a little... Eccentric? Tell me about it. 
but he wouldn't send us here for his amusement. Keep an open mind. All right. Did you see that? Oh, that auto scans, huh? Yeah, no wonder I never don't recall. Hang on a second. No wonder I don't recall like actually scanning them ever. But I did remember knowing what they're called. I was hoping they'd let me do the drop in on them. Now, this is a little puzzle too, and part of what took me so long is trying to do puzzles out of order. So I physically can't do this one right now. Um, so I'm just gonna leave. Like I'm not skipping it. It's just somewhere between really impossible or not really impossible really hard to impossible so i'm just gonna save my time and go also can't remember which abilities i've actually taken in this run compared to the first because i didn't do much in the way of trying to make sure stuff stayed the same Shit, that almost knocked me off the wrong way, but we made it. There's another winter storm rolling up too right now, which is definitely an it's the weather right now in Missouri is just going crazy because there'll be like earlier today, 60 degree weathers like for one hour or like up into like a class. Now walk outside from that class and it's like 30 to 40 degrees. So whatever the storm is gonna be is gonna go crazy. I think I got this ability in my last one, but I didn't get it this time because I don't use that ability. I don't, I never dodge once. I always do a roll dodge. And this one, actually, I've never looked at this one. That one wouldn't be bad to have actually, but it takes two force abilities or two uh, skill points. I will take the increased force right now since I do use the uh, dash ability uh, constantly pretty much. Can't even say a lot. All right, so now I gotta figure out what. Oh, never mind. I almost left him. I don't want to leave these open because they can be hard to push through sometimes. Not even push through, just walk past. But that's opened up this area, and there's a tomb guardian down there, too. Um, Let's see. Oops, not what I meant to do. Let's see how many times I have to do this before I get it. Okay. I jumped way too early. Oh shit, I got it. All right. I like how it highlights some of the larger stuff too that you might not turn and check out. So apparently wherever that thing is, which I think is the the uh, meditation zone that we we're just at has a Zephyr statue staring down right at it. Cool. I'm glad I got that first try this time because it took me like six tries when I did it by myself the first time. Ooh, I almost jumped clean off because I'm forgetting how the wind is blowing and not slowing down to check. Uh, there you go. That's what I get. Oh, it's still counted though. Okay. We definitely ran past some enemies down there too, but I, uh. This lightsaber can't solve everything. <laughs> Okay. Oh, you, uh, that. All right, whatever. That shit was supposed to have been and come out. I saw the thing start to pop out um from below me, but usually they just go off. Like they pop up as I'm getting closer, and then the wind blows them away. But somehow that one just didn't, and ends up. Um, ended up uh, hitting me in the back. 
I want to see if he'll shoot and break this though. Uh, doesn't look like he's going to shoot at all. Oops, that's definitely going to, there it is. I had a feeling that that would happen, but I never took the time or not took the time, but I never remember to actually do it. Damn. Okay, I was trying to use that ability that I ended up not being able to get for some reason. I'll check it out. This will be my first time getting this force echo actually. So I wonder if it's going to, I wonder if it's going to like be something different or like unique. Cause it looks way bigger than you. Oh wait, no, I don't think this is a force echo. I think this is a, one of the ability increasers. Yep. Force essence acquired. An offering to the wind. It was destroyed intentionally for some reason. Okay. So I think he said this fort, this horse, this temple was made as an offering to the wind and was intentionally destroyed. Now, I like how incorporated the reason for the wind being a thing here, instead of it just being like, yeah, they had, they like fans and, <laughs> and vents like AC was the real thing for them. No, it was like reason and intent behind it, which I like in architecture too, uh, like cool features that also like features that make stuff look good but also are functional i'll check it out okay ancient statues um I also tried to increase like some of the recording qualities on the game too. Damn. Damn. I do think that it still might be a little dark though on the recordings. I don't want to make it like super high either. Okay, I was nowhere near that. Focus. The Jedi do not seek aggression, but we stand against it. The force is there to shield us. The obstacles in your path define the path. What stands in the way becomes the way. Now, try again. <clears throat> Good. Continue. Faster now. Complete the test. <clears throat> I'm having a win, not you, dog. Cool. Stands in the way. Oops, frozen. Okay, now there's something back here too that we can get to. There's actually two things back behind us which I want to check out because actually no, th this is it. Because that's the first wall that we found. I don't remember it leads back to here. So I really just started at the end of this puzzle. Well, actually, it's technically started at the beginning, but you're supposed to figure out that this was a puzzle back there. This guardian was destroyed long ago. A long since destroyed guardian. Okay. So what was in there? It's Livian iron. I like the way some of these things. Well, duh. they're supposed to be different, but. Some of them sound like they're from different areas too. Like Slivian sounds like uh so, fuck. Naturally, never mind. I don't know where I'm going with that. My friend, take a look at the detail on this bark. The distinctive striations. It can only be a Rosha tree from Kashik. It's time to call on our old friend. If the Zeppel had contact with Kashyyyk, there is a good chance Chieftain Tarful will know about it. A 
Um. Whoa! Oh, I realized I could jump over that uh that beam too. Damn! I thought I was out of range for that. I don't want to stun it. There we go. There we go. Yeah, you felt weird. I kind of like the way this armor is set up. It reminds me of stuff in like Anthem or the Iron Monger suit or the Mark One suit, I think is what it's called. Because Iron Monger, at least according to MCU, not the comic books. I don't know what Iron Monger is in the comic books, but still, like that crude Iron Man suit is what it reminds me of. That leads us back to here. So we have this puzzle to complete also. Um, and I'm going to do it too. One thing I like about, well, actually not even one thing I like, every Star Wars game and every Star Wars in general understands the importance of the Wookiees. And I don't remember the other dude's names. I mean, to save that last force ability, actually. Oh, well, but understands the importance of putting the Wookiees in, like knowing your audience. I'm going to get this one so I can regain force uh, passively instead of having, or not passively, more actively. So I do use that dash a lot to dash from enemy to enemy. I understand the importance of uh, the Wookiees and there's another inhabitants of Kashyyyk as well. I can't remember their names though, but it's like the little teddy bear ones I think are also on Kashyyyk. I can't remember their names though. That's all he had to say? I would have thought he said more or something. Okay, so I kind of remember a lot of the stuff about this. Um, uh, I don't say nothing. I'm literally doing it right now. I remember some stuff about this. Uh, what you call it? This puzzle. I think I said it before too, but I think uh, like in a more open world type of Star Wars game, I know they made one before. I'm pretty sure it's like uh, Knights of the Old Republic. Where you can choose between like a bounty hunter, Jedi, Sith, all stuff like that. And like go out like a RPG Star Wars game. I think one of those would be cool too, like seeing a new one. Cause I know there's been a lot of new stuff, especially like the Mandalorian series coming out, the new, uh, And like, well, not even the new, but like going more into with Yoda's race, the Gro and the Groguin. I was going to, ooh, I was going to fuck that up. No, but like Yoda's race of people who I know have a specific name, but I can't remember it right now. Okay. Now what? I think I got to go back up this way. I have to get like one or two more balls first, I think. <clears throat> Cause I can't get up this way without one of them being in that pedestal, but I can't remember where else they come from. Let's see. There's one down here to put it on. I can't remember where else I'm supposed to go to get it. I do like how BB uh, art shit. I like how BD will give you hints too. Well, let's see. Can I find this other one without needing him? I don't remember what's down this way or if I've ever been down this way, actually. Or if this is a shortcut back to a different way that I came. It is okay.
Oh, I don't know what's happening. Okay, let's see. Oh, another one of these. Like I said, I literally was incapable of opening this before. Uh, well, at least I could have used the wind to get it around, I think. Because the first time... The first time I did it, I was definitely trying that. And what else? This is open now, too. I think that was supposed to help to do it without using the wind, but I just kind of pushed it to where it needed to be. But I want to finish this puzzle first. I can't remember what it gets me, but oh, I remember where I'm supposed to go. Or I think I remember part of where I'm supposed to go, actually. Yep, right there. I like that sprint backflip slice thing that he does. It's, I like the, the abilities that are out of motion or create motion as well. Oh, you can dash around the... I almost said board, but dash around... Why would I even think to say board? It's not a board game, but that way you can dash around the battlefield uh, and get stuff done that way. I do believe that this is the last one. We gotta push this down this track. Oh. Gonna take it all the way around. Don't have to worry about this one getting lost or anything though. Cause it has this little dish for it to land in if it'll stop moving. There we go. I don't know where this is going. Oh, I think it only came up slightly. Oh, it opens this door up. And now, I think we just have to do that last one, which is going to involve taking out. <gasps> Ooh, I almost burped straight into the mic. You probably still knew it, though, because I caught it in a weird way. But we can get this one out now. And that's going to let us do some more stuff. No. I do believe I can just wait here for it. Yep. I'll fall off. Okay, cool. And now that brings us way up here. And I think this is the way out, actually. So this wasn't <laughs> this wasn't really a puzzle more as what I was supposed to do. Oops. I didn't actually mean to let this out of its spot just yet. But it's out now, so. I don't know what that does, actually. That one. But I, th I think it's just the activation for this thing. Yeah, because now it's locking me up intentionally, so. What did you find? The Zephyr went to Kashyyyk. Cordova mentioned someone named Tarful. Uh, a Wookiee chieftain. They were old friends. Think he's still around? There's only one way to find out. We have to go to Kashyyyk. Right. Well, I think that's. Are we going down? No, no, no. The walls. Why does it look like? Why does it look like it's going down? Hmm. I'm very confused. There's some sort of optical illusion occurring here. Because we're definitely going up, but it looks like the walls are going downward. Well, it, actually, it looks like we're going downward because the walls are going upward. I wonder what that was. Maybe we're twisting and that's what was throwing, off, throwing it off for me. Right, so... I have nothing on the skill tree. I might as well rest now so I've started at full health because we have to run this gauntlet of Imperial scum, I guess. But that's going to be all for this video. Uh, thanks for watching, and I'll see you on the next one.